hello my traumatized babies and mentally ill barbies i just had a fun little outing and now i'm back but unfortunately i was also talking to a friend who's going through some stuff and unfortunately some of that stuff is stuff that's been showing up through the reads in general so i feel kind of bad and i'm looking to hopefully maybe lift my spirits with a read though i don't know if that's going to be able to happen but I don't know, I just wanna do something because it was some heavy energy. And I'm hoping things turn out okay for my friend. What's at the bottom of the Oracle deck? We have abundance, that's a nice message. An abundance of romance. We'd love to see it and trust. Okay, we will. We will. I don't know. Will we? Will we trust? Will there be an abundance of romance for some of y'all? Maybe new starts, I'm hearing? Oh. We had two flip up here. Ah, oh, we've gotten this a lot lately. I'll wait to talk about it. Let's see what's at the bottom of the deck change change is coming like we've got change imprisonment and mature woman here if you've been feeling maybe kind of stuck where you are it could be anything right now there's kind of nothing on the table just yet let me get our first row of tarot out and then i'll flip over these maybe i'll flip over everything who knows we'll see but if you've been feeling stuck somewhere, looks like a change is coming. And I'm sorry, I'm looking kind of wild right now. I got home after being like out all day and I just wiped all my makeup off with a wipe and just like did some chores and threw my hair back. And now I'm just like, I look wild right now. Hmm. A nice little flip up. Another flip up. We've got the Six of Wands, the Hanged Man, and the World. I... I think someone's thinking about something. They're thinking about either wanting to be like the center of attention, the center of your attention, yeah, it's something about like the center of attention. Got this King of Cups with the Ace of Cups, like someone wanting, and this Three of Cups with the lovers, like, and then the Two of Swords, I'm just taking that as that's where this message is ending. It's like, I have somebody here who either wants to be the center of like a lot of people's romantic attention or they want to be the center of like maybe explicitly your romantic attention. I'm not sure. We have in this first row with the oracles, we have peaceful resolution with pathway and the four of pentacles. And right now I'm getting this as somebody like outside of y'all like somebody's trying to like it's whoever this is who i'm talking about like someone wanting to be the center of p potentially your attention and it's sort of like they're making their way like peaceful right now i don't feel past person energy on this because i'm seeing peaceful resolution Unless something different pops up, I'm not getting that. It just seems like there's someone trying to make their way to y'all with like either some stuff in hand or as much as they can, I'm not sure. We've got a yes, so we'll just say that I'm very right. I'm always very right. Oh, false person. Now, we've got the Ace of Pentacles. That's why it's like somebody coming to 
give something because we've got this person making their way right coming down the pathway for this p and i'm saying it's like i don't think the peaceful resolution i think yes ultimately they want to get to y'all but it's sort of like they want the pathway to be like clear for them and then we have this false person yes and ace of pentacles it's like they're coming to give this thing perhaps to say something i don't know but it's something in the material world and this false person I'm getting a little bit of a different read on this at the moment. Not so much a false person, but someone who's kind of like incognito. Like this person may be like watching, they may be in the background somewhere. And it's not false as in they're a fake or a bad person. It's false as in they're not presenting to you. If this is some, that like, this is likely with this ace of pentacles someone who is in your life right now but like in the like because we have like the false person in the foreground and then like the man in the background and what i get is this person isn't like at the forefront of your life they are kind of in the background and also they are not presenting to you as they truly feel if I get something different off of that, I will say so as we keep going. So what's in this last row? Okay. We have look for a sign with the mature man, message, and then the tarot is the seven of cups. And I think this mature man is this person with the four of pentacles, is this false person, is that king of cups beneath the deck. And I don't know if they are waiting for a sign. I'm getting a yes. It's sort of like they're they're waiting for something. They're like looking like, like the seven of cups is them. Like usually in the... Um, in the Smith weight deck, like we have a cup like right here that's, thank you, get out of here. We have a cup up here that's like outlined in red and that's like the true cup and everything else is kind of a distraction. And when I'm like, that's the sign here. This person is waiting on whatever that moment is, that right timing is to kind of maybe present themselves and make themselves known. Okay, we'll go around again, and then I might use the smaller deck to clarify some of these oracles, perhaps. Oh. Now we've got a look. Whoa. Uh, yeah, all right. This Four of Pentacles, right? We've got this Page of Pentacles on top of this Four of Pentacles. This is someone, I'm telling you, with this false person... You can see they're both kind of looking, right? Like we've got the page looking at the peacock and the false person kind of, you know, looking over their little fan and thinking to themselves, yes, I like what's over there. I like what I, I, like what I see, right? And usually this is representative to me that peacock is the queen of pentacles, right? We've got all pentacles, like four of pentacles, ace of pentacles, page of pentacles. So, you know, maybe we're also dealing with the King of Pentacles besides the King of Cups. We'll see if maybe he comes out. Um, but this person is sort of like looking, wanting, because like the page is the one holding this ace right here. And what are they thinking as they're looking? Well, you know, we've got the Devil and the Ten of Cups. So it seems like that's reading to me as being very physically attracted to you. It's also reading a little bit like, you know, obsession, perhaps, like not in a creeper way. It's just that they're having a hard time keeping you off their mind. I don't think that they want to, but like this more carnal, fiery, spicy energy is also being tempered by the Ten of Cups. So they're also seeing you or imagining building some sort of fulfillment with you. I think they think that 
like besides all of this other stuff, they could likely have some form of a home with you. And I'm not sure if we're meaning like a physical home here or if we're talking about like you, you're, you would feel like home to this person or eventually you could get to somewhere like that within your relationship. And my eye keeps getting drawn back to that yes, exclamation point. Oh, we have the king of swords. Yeah, with the false person, it kind of makes sense. It's sort of like, I just think that that's more of this person. Like, because, like, the way this looks on the table is like he's looking, like, slyly backwards at this four of pentacles, page of pentacles, devil, and the 10 of cups. He's kind of like sitting there and kind of like thinking about it, right? Thinking, but keeping the thoughts like to themselves, not showing. Um, and this person also might be going through something at the moment because above the king of swords in the background, if you can see there's Saturn back there. So this person, yeah, look at that, nine of swords. Nine of swords at the bottom, something tough, four of cups. Three of cups, two of cups, five of wands, death. Five of swords, something, seven of swords, something's happening. Something's happening, let me look at this. <laughs> this person at the moment I'm not getting this person like I know we get that little like divorce narrative sometimes I don't know that this is the same narrative I think that this is more of a someone has maybe like with this nine of swords, it's like a type of, like I'm taking this four of cups, three of cups, and two of cups all together as like one energy. It's sort of like the way this person has operated with like partners or their love life or things like that has led to like nothing but drama. And they are putting an end to that with the death card and they are doing it by their own hand like pretty swiftly and ruthlessly with this five of swords, all right? And I've got this seven of swords here. I'm just getting like, you know, take, well, this is strategy, right? As they're putting an end to this, they're also figuring out their next move. And that's kind of where this person is with that more difficult Saturn energy right now. And that makes sense if they're reflecting on Here's what I've been doing. Here's the past and I see this future. I see what this could be, but like, there are some things that I need to figure out here. I'm shuffling this before pulling on this Seven of Cups. Also this Cups, there could be like a little bit of excess of drinking here, or there was. Hearing a little bit of still is, but it's not like, like a full blown issue, right? It's just that, yeah, like nine of cups. This person is thinking about like what they really want, but I also get like, <sighs> there is a little bit of overindulgence going on here. Let's get one more and then maybe we'll do some clarifiers. What are you doing, Dessa? Y'all are scampering around. What's wrong, baby? Uh -huh. Two of swords. But like it's like they're blocked. Is that what it is? Blocked? Well, no, it's not blocked. It's, um... Again, the not showing, not showing what they want. It's this, like, right here. Like, I'm not showing what I want. Um, okay, <laughs> well, 
but working. I had a queen of swords. Queen of pentacles. Ooh, maybe we are in the divorce narrative. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe not. All right, let's clarify this pathway. Yeah. Um, wherever this person is currently, the Four of Cups, they just, they don't want to be here anymore. They're bored. They're bored. Everything's run its course. And they're also thinking. Yeah, because the, th the Three of Cups, they're looking at the, like, whatever this person was doing, they're looking at that Three of Cups on the Four of Cups, like, the, the Fourth Cup is being presented to them, like, more of this? And this person is like, no. No, because it only leads that Three of Cups with my relationships and whatever, maybe drinking only leads, yeah, my relationships. It only leads to upset. It only leads to grief. So now, like, yeah, this is the end. So this person is now kind of working things out, getting things together, and we're full circle because the first card that, the first tarot that was in this row was the Four of Pentacles. So now we're back at the Four of Pentacles. We are back at where this person is now, working and kind of holding on to their stuff, being guarded. Can we get one more? Maybe about, yeah, like they're building themselves up. to be whatever they feel like they need to be to make their move. What about this false person? It's also likely that just through their experiences, they've matured. This false person is the page of, yeah, watching. So like, <laughs> this person is just like, hmm, I see something. I see something I want, but I'm just, you know, just watching it. I'm just watching it. What about this King of Swords? It, it, like, it's not anybody. It's not a bad false person card. It's just covert activity going on in your energy. Ah, the King of Swords with the Knight of Swords. So there's like this Oh, yeah, the, like this Knight of Swords is facing like this Ten of Cups and the Devil. Like they want to go this way. Ah, yeah, make that little Six of Cups offer to this person, to y'all, whoever y'all are. Yeah, to me, <laughs> I want to go this way to make this romantic gesture. Six of Cups is still at the bottom. And so they're working. They're working to do that. I don't... I don't know that we're gonna get anything else. Um, let's do this Two of Swords first. Yeah, it's a secret. Like they're not, um, they, they're not showing it to anybody how hard they're working to do this. They're doing all their little hard work to move to where they need to go in private. There's a Three of Wands at the bottom. It's more motion, movement. And then the judgment is like that sign that I'm talking about. So, what's the sign? A star. I'm getting that kind of metaphorically at the moment. They're waiting for the stars to be right. What I mean by that is it's not like an external sign. They are waiting to get their shit in order in order to do this because they want to have enough to give and they want to look like a big deal, right? They wanna be a big deal. All right, so what about this message? Message in a bottle, uh, 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 uh. They're stressed out about it. Yeah, don't know why. Oh, the internet could be an email. So I have this two of um, wands right here and sometimes I get that as like, they're stressed out 
about sending, because this is electron, like fire is also electricity, okay? So it's something that they're looking to communicate over electricity, over the internet, like the world. That's typically how that looks for me. And this devil seems irrelevant, but I think that's just them. Like, it's just on their mind, right? It's that Nine of Swords stuff. It's just like on their mind, on their mind, on their mind. And then, oh, the two that came out for the actual message. Yeah. A message, something, some form of direct communication across the world. It's like I'm saying, this is likely going to be over the internet or through your phone. I don't know... I'm gonna say, I don't know if this person's in the same place as you. And I mean like location wise. Yeah, no, they're somewhere else. Don't know where they are, don't know. Huh, hmm. Okay, well, let's see if we can get maybe some Next steps going into the future, potential outcome, maybe, because I mean, nothing I can do about any of that. That person has to decide to move when they're good. Um, over here. All right, next steps or outcome. Oh, interesting. There's our Knight of Wands with the Ace of Cups and the Six of Swords. Yeah, they're like, they're figuring, like, they gotta wait. They gotta wait until something's right. I don't know. I don't know. Whoa. What the hell? Um, so we have here the Ten of Swords, the Tower, and the magician and i'm getting like this is what's happening right now for this person like they are the ones causing this in their surroundings by what they're doing but even though they are the agent of this stuff like this seems like necessary things that need the ten of swords and the tower and they're being very like you can see this person's expression right it's like no i'm freaking doing this um it's still a lot to deal with energetically like that's why like there's no way that someone would be able to take steps toward another person until they had resolved this and also likely worked through like gotten some of that energy off of them On the Ten of Swords, we have the Page of Cups. So yeah, after that is done, that Ten of Swords, after that's done, then that little page, was, oh, here's our King of Pentacles at the bottom. With the sun, after things are clear for this King of Pentacles, then they can take the chariot to the Nine of Pentacles as the Emperor. See this tower? Yeah, after it's done, then they're 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 moving. There, two of wands at the bottom. So they're aligning everything themselves. Could y'all knock it off? I don't know what they're doing. They're being weird. Y'all are being weird. Why do you always want to be weird while I'm doing a read? They're completely normal when I'm not on camera. And then immediately I start doing the read and they start doing weird crap. That Saturn energy is back under the deck. They're going through it, whatever it is. Yeah, and then um, the, tr the, the, the movement. The Page of Cups, the Three of Wands to the Eight of Wands. So once that is at an end, they are free to get into this Page of Cups energy 
once the tower has crumbled, then they'll be able to move. What is happening? What's happening? Where are you? Hold on, y'all. Yeah, I don't know. Dasa was like in a drawer or something. Oh my god. Um. So then this person. I'm all discombobulated. So then after the tower and like this person is in position, the three of wands, then they will able be able to move. That's like movement, but it also might just be the communication, the messages. Because I was going to be like, this person, if they're at a distance from you, they would need to move locations entirely. So... How does this person know you? All right. <laughs> I literally, like, see this Four of Swords here? And when I, this popped up, I was like, this person saw you in their dreams. It's also like, cause I have the eight of swords next to this. Like these two are together, this four of swords and this eight of swords. This person, it's possible they were hospitalized. Or like, in th like I'm, I'm sorry to be rude about this, but it's sort of like, this is almost like, um, and I'm using this colloquially, I don't mean this literally. This person was possibly in like a padded cell, an asylum, an asylum. They were in a treatment center, a ward, they might, or this is like during therapy, and then they left for this 10 of pentacles. So, in the community, I don't know that they like saw y'all here. Cause it's like this, this confinement as well. It's sort of like, it's likely after they left that. And then maybe now, try that one more time, go around. I don't know, this seems kind of wild to me. It's also possible that they saw you in a church or a graveyard. I don't know. The city is a graveyard. I'm haunted by your love. Um, judgment on the Four of Swords. Ah, they could, like dreams. This y'all are talking on the 5D, okay? Like, y'all are on the 5D. <laughs> But that's also recovery, right? Like the four of some, like they're getting up, like these people are getting up, they've been revitalized. So then the hanged man on the eight of swords. So I might have seen you. It's well, that's also like the head, right? Dreams or thinking. It's also a time of stasis. It makes sense to be with the Eight of Swords. And then this Eight of Cups. The Moon. The Moon is also in the Eight of Cups. So they're being drawn by something. Likely by what they know, right? Because the Moon, like, the Moon and the halo around the person's head so they're being drawn by the moon. Some sort of maybe intuitive magnetic force. And there is a pathway on the moon too. And on the eight of cups, that person is walking on the pathway that we saw at the beginning of the read. So the Ten of Coins, which is our, also our match and the read for the Ten of Cups. 
And we have the five of coins here for how this person knows you. Someone outside their community. It could be like you're an accepting person. Oh yeah, the queen of cups, like king of wands under the deck. Putting a death to the queen of wands. I don't think that's a, mm. Might've been a long-term relationship, but it wasn't anything good if it was. I don't know that I'm getting marriage off of that. Um, this is just them seeing you because like the 10 of coins, the five of coins and the queen of cups. The five of coins, again, like the five of coins and the four of swords, like it's like church energy. It's also like, you know, shelter energy, like the 10 of coins and the five of coins, like we, we take people in. I don't know if y'all actually do that sort of work, but as the queen of cups, like this person would see you as like an accepting person, maybe someone very spiritual, someone who helps people in need or you know offers what you can to people in need it would be also likely that this person if they see you as someone who is wealthy they're also kind of seeing you as someone who's like very generous and also not you know stuck up or anything and then justice <sighs> I don't know, like strength at the bottom of the deck and the six of coins and the page of pentacles. Like this is something about like volunteer work, social justice, nonprofit work, mutual aid, charity work, something like that. But through what medium? Like how? I'm gonna cut it off because I think I'm just like, I'm just dicking around in the energy. And it's just like, me, like I've probably told you all you need to know. Through what medium? What avenue? What realm? This is two people like linked by something. It could be the material world, but what it, like what's the link? What is the link? I see that they're linked, but what is the link? It's somebody in your world. So hold on, let me look at this. I'm telling you, it's somebody who's watching you. Like they're watching you, but they're in the freaking background. That irritates me so much. How watching? How are they watching though? How? Through what means? I don't think it's gonna tell me. I'll try one more time. Through what means are they watching the collective? It's the King of Swords again. We know who it is, but how? How? It's someone in, like, the only thing I'm getting confused by, oh, um, what I was 
gonna say is what I'm getting confused by is that I told you earlier in the read that this person is not where you are. Like they would have to leave a location to come to yours, it seems like. Like I said, like the internet and things like that. Like I, I don't know, it's kind of nebulous. They just might be elsewhere in your city or state. I don't know, but here's the thing. The way that you are linked is through the devil. Now, the devil is the ruler of the material world. Oh, right, okay, that took me a second. Jesus, I'm like, right though, what, what? <laughs> He's also the prince of the air, the prince of the air, through the air, through the air, electricity, airwaves, the internet, this person is watching you. Like, as you can see, like, he's not in the material world. He's watching. He's watching you in your material world. He has stepped away in the air with his own little pentacle at his feet. This is likely, like to me, this is like, like lives, Zoom, potentially work Zoom. Um, it could be any type of social media where there's like a lot of different channels and like people go live there are like together meetings over the air because this is like this page of pentacles is also I'm watching, like it's the same thing as the, um, the two of wands almost, that person at a distance with the world in their hand, looking at the world, this person's looking at the pentacle, looking at their phone. It's something like that. And they're not saying anything, but they're watching. Jesus, that took me a while to figure out. I, I am like, I'm, I almost want to, I need to just stop. Cause it almost feels like too much of a stretch. And they're saying it's not, but I was just like, what the hell? I always forget I start going through the devil's names. It's like, he's pointing up. Like he's pointing up. It's like, oh, cause of the air. Because of the air. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Um, I mean, yeah, it's just, it's on repeat now. I'm going to close the read because we got the tower again. This person is putting an end to this crap. And then they're going to need to work through the energy of that, right? Before they get to a space where they can, you know, be free and do whatever it is that they want to do. Um, can we get any sort of timeline on that? I'm like really pushing it. Um, oh, oh, quickly. Likely quicker than you think for this shift, this move with them, okay? Um, six days, six weeks. For the swords, that's the fastest moving energy coupled with the chariot. Okay. But that would be for the message, right? I don't know. Like, if this person is literally, like, in another state or somewhere else in the world, it's not likely unless a lot of the energy that I've been talking about is in the past. And, you know, they've been doing all of this and now they're ready to move. But likely and also don't like don't focus too hard on the timelines i would just say you know in general when all of this stuff is done and when the stars are right 